Welcome back after the break, my friends. Now I often wonder what maketh a great designer. I would imagine that some amount of artistic talent is quintessential. Other than that, you must also have an extremely heightened sense of aesthetics with respect to line, color, shape, form, proportion, balance, and also have a great eye for detail. Now, other than this, it also helps greatly if a designer has the right kind of aptitude and flair for design, which he can then later hone and supplement in the right kind of institute, because only then can you come up with a very good and professional portfolio. And believe me, more often than not, it's this portfolio that will take you places. Having said that, it's now time to go find out about the specialties of Sagar Tenali. Watch this. Everybody struggles in any field. Yeah. I mean, see, I did struggle a lot. I mean, when I just passed out of my NAFT, my parents didn't wanted me to go out of, uh, uh, you know, uh, AP uh, to work outside and all. But then, you know, uh, so I, 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 I stuck to Hyderabad, uh, and then I struggled a lot for my work and all. I really couldn't get my place right. And then I, I went and worked for movies, and then I had a very bad experiences with them in terms of payments, in terms of time management, and all. And then I, I struck, I did some freelancing in the beginning days, and then I did, I did work as a stylist for some people. I did, you know, work, job works for some other companies and all. I did so many things. Those were all the struggling days, and you know. But then I never gave up on my, you know, my dream. Like I wanted to become the best designer in town and all. And I, I know that I'm reaching there now, and I'm almost there. And my next uh, project in my mind is like, you know, to get into Fashion Week. Now there's 2010 uh, sp Spring Summer Fashion Week. So I'm, we are working hard towards it now. You know, once I'm, I go there now, I'll be you known, you know, national level, and then you will have a wide uh, exposure in terms of national level well, now people will know nationally also uh, right now also I do supply my clothes uh, nationally I do supply my clothes to Bangalore folio and all I do supply Azam men in uh, Bombay I do supply in uh, uh, Chennai uh, uh, Chennai two stores in Chennai and all so yes but the fashion week is something wherein you know uh, all the fashion fraternity will be watching you and all you know that's something you know which will give you more kick Sagar was first into men's fashion as he felt that it was a vastly ignored sphere. However, he later ventured into women's fashion as well. He is one of the few who designs ethnic and party wear for men under his label Sagar Tenali. To become a very professionally uh, learned designer, I think there are two good institutes I could refer. One is NAFT where I passed out from and there is another institute called NID, National Institute of Design. So these two are the pioneer in uh, in this industry. So you know if you, but I know yes definitely it's not that easy to get into this but if you really work hard towards it and then if you take some training outside and then you know uh, get into it I think that's the best institute what you have. But I don't think so there's no, there's no uh, you know uh, use if you just do for a three years course, four years course because this this designing is something wherein you need to learn full time morning till evening and then you work on it after hours also you work towards it and then you learn more of it you know there's a wide range of you know uh, uh, research you need to do in this field so you know I think these are the two good institutes where you can apply and then you know you can just uh, pass out from that and then you'll have a certified uh, course in your hand so you can go ahead and then there's a wide range of options which you can do after these courses. This gutsy young man manages to satisfy his customers by dishing out quality products and innovative ideas. See, nowadays customers are very, very uh, uh, well known uh, about fashion, about trends, about the fabrics. They are well aware of fashion. What I would say is like they are well knowledge about fashion now because everybody is traveling throughout the world. Everybody is becoming a globetrotters and all. So you know they know what is in, what is out now. So you just can't fool around your customers nowadays. It's like so as a designer, first thing what I would say is I'll sit with them, I have an appointment with them, then I'll talk to them what exactly they want and then for what occasion they want to wear and then you know I'll then uh, ask them what are the colors they like and all and then I feel I, I speak to 
them like what are you know what they feel comfortable in and then you know then we'll sit and we'll discuss and then we'll decide according to skin tone according to their body structure and all according to their height you know what suits them what pattern suits them what fabrics will suits their body structure and all that's how i you know i i develop a rapport with the customer first and all you know to be a labeled successful designer his brand must meet the approval of the film industry and sagar made his mark there too by designing clothes for a number of actors actresses in tollywood when i designed for my first movie uh, for uh, nitin uh, because teja director called me up and then he asked me to do a, a song sequence they shot it in uh, belgium uh, and uh, jordan and uh, those cloth those uh, outfits are very dramatic i mean we needed a lot of you know uh, ground work to do on that because they were like you know chasing scene and they had like queen and the king and all it's more like a theatrical costumes we had to do basing on the victorian era and all so that 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 took a lot of work for us to do and then when we did it and it came out so very well that you know they called me back and said you know everything was so excellently done and then they they appreciated me a lot for my work and that was my most unforgettable uh, moment yeah to have a true measure of sagar's worth we need to keep in mind that the fashion capital in the country is mumbai and for a designer to make it in a place like hyderabad is a rarity when it comes to fashion i think this is a very good uh, field uh see rajan just going to blindly you know there's so many doctors there's so many engineers and all i think this is a, this is one field wherein uh, the people have not yet known it because lack of awareness i feel this is a very good field you have a lot of uh, options to uh, make your life good in this and earn good money and then at the same time yes it has its own drawbacks as well as well as positive aspects but then if you can just look and concentrate only on positive aspects and if you have the zeal to work hard i think this is the field this is the best field where you have lot of options to work and earn good money